when we started this uh, project, the, the, uh, the idea was to see whether or not technology can help small older farmers. Um, and whether it's the robot or whether it's the smartphone or wh whatever it might be, we're just trying to look at different technology. Production is the main problem here. Okay. We only touched very briefly on some of the constraints. Technology, lack of technology, you'll soon see. Mm -hmm. If you want to produce for markets like these markets or any market, modern market, you need to be very efficient. Technology, uh, know-how, all that kind of stuff. Just like you do. Mm. We, we are not even, we, we're basically moving from subsistence majority of our farmers are still subsistent, mm -hmm. just hand to mouth, hand yeah. to mouth. Yeah. And then a little bit of surplus that you see, you will see a, a lot. A little bit of surplus, <coughs> but it's, it's unpredictable. Quality, What we're trying to do here with the, the system is, is is try and build a, a a platform that can be remotely controlled or towed or even run on its own. That's one part, and the other part is the crop intelligence. So the the, the smartphone or the camera systems or whatever it might be, along with some algorithms. The whole idea being, can you digitize the agronomy? Can you can you provide the agronomy doctor to the or the yeah. tame doctor, whatever it might be, to the farm? So if the farmer takes photos, um, it says how much fertilizer to put, or whether it's a yeah. pest or a disease. When you want to do the quantum leap yeah. from subsistence to commercial, yeah. you know. You don't do it in small steps. Okay. <laughs> As somebody said, if you if you're going over the gas, and you don't do it in you, you do it one step, not little steps yeah, yeah, across, yeah. Uh, across the across the uh -huh. so, so this is the kind of thing we need to do. You don't know you need people to pull everybody up. Okay. And and get the get the industry on its feet. Yeah. And solve the kind of stuff that you just see. We need to overcome. High prices, lack of uh, you need you need the whole thing yeah. to work, yeah. and then other people will start coming. Okay, so that and that's the question that we have, which is, I mean, fundamentally, can this type of technology, which can be low cost, especially if it's a smartphone, or whatever, can it bring the cost down, but increase quality and 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 sustainability? Yeah.